In Illinois, workers are harvesting ice at Klein Creek Farm. This was once an important industry, especially before refrigeration technology became widespread. During the winter, workers cut large blocks of ice from frozen rivers, lakes, and ponds, and then stored these ice blocks in insulated ice houses for year-round use. However, with the advent of electric refrigeration technology, the demand for natural ice sharply declined, and by the mid-20th century, ice harvesting had largely become a thing of the past. So, how were the ice blocks insulated? First, the walls of the ice houses were very thick, often designed with air layers or using insulating materials like wood, stone, and brick to enhance the insulation effect. Additionally, workers would use sawdust around and on top of the ice blocks to reduce heat transfer. During the busiest seasons, Klein Creek Farm could cut and transport dozens or even hundreds of tons of ice each day. 